Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Today I'm here with Mahoka Koko no Retose season 2 episode number 9. Okay, uh, the previous episode, uh, nothing much happened but a little bit of uh, some new developments happened. That is, uh, the parasites are like trying to uh, get back, um, uh, what was uh, the android's name? Uh, Pix Pixie, yeah, Pixie. Uh, was trying to get her back and they tried to mess, mess with Tasuya and they got what they deserved <laughs> so <laughs> like um yeah so let's see like how they're going to uh like move forward from this and also we got to see another new character uh that is uh, that uh black haired girl um i can't remember her name uh, but she's from the yosuba family and she came to uh uh, <clears throat> like f to the uh, that commander uh virginia her name was wasn't it and like they talked a bit and <laughs> like stuff like that those happens those political kind of uh things that uh, like they usually do uh, the, uh as as always like the yosuba family is one of the biggest families and they are not liking the whole uh, uh like foreigners coming in and messing with their like town so yeah things are bound to go this way so that and Mm, yeah that was it like that was basically the previous episode so let's see uh, how this goes and how this episode plays out so without further ado let's get started with episode number nine of mahoka koko noreto se season two all right i'll be putting the subtitles and the timer here sync to whichever is your preference and let's get started here's a countdown three two one go okay here it is Oh yeah, this thing happened, um, like when Pixie was saving Onoka. This guy. H. Hmm. Okay. Nano machine element. Yeah, <laughs> kind of. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> well, this is giving new ideas to this guy. Like, he's probably like now going to think about like using them, them as weapons or something. Who knows? Like, I kind of thought like this might be going to happen. Like, uh, obviously, like Pixie and uh, the like. Parasite them like combining it's in a weird thing in itself Because obviously like an Android is a mechanical thing and a parasite is supposed to be an organic stuff Even though this is a kind of a different type of parasite and it's like uh, made from like the uh, experiment from the black hole bombs, but <clears throat> Yeah, this in itself is quite fascinating. So like a completely unique case so I thought maybe like something like this was gonna happen like other like other parties would like have their eyes on Pixie and like try to take them back take him like take Pixie with them but that's it there so <laughs> I doubt anything's going to happen <laughs> Hmm. Okay. <laughs> well, that takes care of that. Hmm. Oh, Erika. Hmm. <laughs> 
Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like they Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Well, obviously they're connected somehow. Oh. Process. Resonance. All right. Okay. Resonance is more. Yeah, that we know. Yeah, resonance is the correct word. Like it. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have some kind of like, like, idea. Yep. Well, basically spe <laughs> speaking, this is um, the power of feelings. <laughs> oh, she was thinking that? <laughs> like, how do you control that? Um... Hmm. Well, leads. Oh, they might be parasites as well. Or not. Uh, no, they're not parasites. Oh, are, are they? Yeah, they might be. Oh, well, a trick. <laughs> or they might be... Okay, shut up. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, oh, boy. Well, yeah. Well, Erika is here. She can handle them, I guess. Oh, my. What the? Oh my. Oh boy, how are we going to dodge it midair? Oh, that's convenient. 
<laughs> All right. Okay, Mikiko took them out. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. They're okay, they're like robots. What about those guys? Oh, someone might come from the back or from the top. <laughs> oh boy. And there it is. Wow, this is like a blimp. And it's kind of invisible to the eye. Yeah, it's kind of transparent looking. Mm, yep. Oh, okay. These are the guys. Hmm. Okay, so they were not parasites, but uh, most probably like these people. Oh, mission failed. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Well, yeah. Oh, that's not it? Mm. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh, and ground defense for. Oh, okay. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Assess marking like <laughs> uh. Oh Yep Oh <laughs> oh. 
okay adding mail to angelina okay got ties to the oh I doubt it's <laughs> well yeah that's also like Yeah. Exactly, like Hmm. Yeah, there's a lot of like things to consider. okay well yeah that's the thing like they took them away that's all well and good but if they like start doing some kind of experiments and stuff and that will be like why oh they're killed okay <laughs> damn that's yeah Oh, si wait a minute. So, the commander, uh, Virginia, she, like, she was writing a mail to uh, Siri, uh, Angelina. That means, like, she asked, oh, boy. she asked, like, the girl, like, the black haired girl, what was her name, Kuroba or thing? To like get them back but then okay i'll talk about this later Yeah. She can't even like hide her own identity. What will she? Oh, that guy. Uh wait. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, he was he was Shizuku. Oh. Wait, yeah, they were like Wait a minute Who, who's Jade? 
Wait. What? <laughs> That's bad. One problem, like Pixie is also a parasite, so. Well, a lot of information. Okay, well, well, there's a lot of things this like suddenly like dumped in this episode and kind of got the whole uh, situation like the uh, basics of it that most like the basic thing is like they're trying to like uh, like just not destroy but to like uh, make magic less powerful and like be under criticism so that like uh, the military strength uh, like military might can be like increased so because obviously that, that has like they have some interest in that uh, like <clears throat> like in that department like they want that to happen so that's why like they're trying to like uh, make magicians bad to the like public eye and trying to like nip it out of the whole um, like society yeah that was i think basically the whole um, thing like there were a lot of um, like a lot of things like a lot of uh, technical things in there like a lot of uh, like that uh, like echelon 3 and like the hacking thing uh, what was his name i can't even pronounce it like skull he's skull or something 
like that th uh, okay here it is and there's was a lot of things but uh, like the main point is like they don't want magic to be the most important thing and want military might to uh, triumph over it so that's why like they're trying to like paint <coughs> magicians as bad people in like public's eyes yeah so okay so that was that and okay so there were a lot of things like we got to see uh, like uh, like the sages uh, two of them like this guy the other uh, person who was like whose hand was cut previously like they showed in the flashback here he was also like uh, sage and um <clears throat> Oh no, he's a boss of Hajime Sukasa. Okay, okay, sorry about that. Uh, oh, um, yeah, he was not that guy. Uh, his boss was, is the sage. All right, okay, so kind of missed that. All right, so um, so yeah, so this guy here, uh, what was his name? This blonde-haired guy. Uh, um, just a sec. Let me check out his name. One of the seven sages. Um, just a sec. Raymond Sage Clark. Okay, Raymond Clark. Okay. Uh, so yeah, this guy. Uh, so Raymond, uh, he decided to like leak that thing, like the uh, uh, like where the parasites are, like kept held, uh, to Angelina. Because he has his own intentions in that. He wants to like destroy the parasites. Uh, because of the reason that he explained to Tatsuya. But he said that uh, Angelina already knew the lo like location. Now, um, this is most probably what happened. Uh, the uh, lady, uh, Virginia, he, uh, she, after uh, learning the location of um, uh, parasites from Kuroba, she uh like she was writing a mail to angelina so she told angelina about the location and told her like ordered her to assassinate them now uh there's a question here why like why did she do that now um one thing one most probable thing uh that can be the reason is that uh one of the passes was uh well one of their guys that is from the USNA, uh, USNA, and uh, uh, that that guy, that uh, like leader kind of guy who was like talking to Tasso in the previous episode, that guy. That can be a reason. I'm not sh completely sure if that is the reason why like she wanted them to like be assassinated, or something else. Like she has something else in plan. I'm not sure about that. Anyways, um, so yeah, so she asked Angelina to kill them and. Angelina went to kill them and uh, Raymond uh, also like contacted her and told uh, her the location but she already knew it so like it it's all well and good for Ra Raymond because obviously he wanted uh, like the assassination of those people and Angelina would have either way did it so yeah now he's also like talking with Tatsuya now and wants him to also uh, like locate all the parasites uh, and like destroy them destroy the parasites because of that reason like um, uh, that he explained that uh, the sages uh, the, uh, one of the sages they want all of the um, magic like magic to go out of this world and to like make the people think that yeah mages or magicians are bad and uh, like increase the military might so that's the reason and this guy doesn't want that he as he said like i'm a rom romanticist and i want uh, like magic to be here i doubt that is the whole reason i don't know because obviously these guys like these type of people usually like um like talk like this but there are like some kind of a hidden ad agenda to them i'm not sure but there might be like he might be like that only who knows like usually uh, strong people kind are kind of um eccentric so he might be one of those guys, like one of those eccentric two OP guys. So, anyways, um, yeah. So he asked Tatsuya to uh, also like go there, and destroy the parasites, 
and either compete with it with uh, um, Angelina or like like work together any anything she can do now here's one thing this poses a problem that is um, pixie what will happen to her like um I don't know most probably she'll also be like uh, dragged in into this and I'm not sure what uh, Raymond has in mind about uh, like I don't even know if he either like whether knows about it like knows about like a uh, parasite in like took a uh, Android as a vessel. I'm not sure like if he knows about like that thing happening if he doesn't know about it Then I think they could probably like keep it uh, a secret, but I'm not sure this guy seems a little bit like like uh, quite a bit too much intelligent and a bit um, Like a, a type of guy who has like ears in each and every place. So you might know it who knows so yeah, then that will pose a problem uh, for Tasuya. And uh, now the main question in this is like, why did um, Virginia ask Angelina to assassinate them? Oh, so, okay. And so a few things happened like a lot of things like happened in this episode like first of all they tried to like transport uh, the parasites like e Erika, uh, Leo and Miki Mikihiko and while doing that they were like stopped by this uh, like the, by um, Saigusa family I'm guessing like they like yeah Saigusa family Saigusa family's people and they snatched him away uh, snatched those three of them away then Tasuya went to Saigusa to ask her for like to just like talk with her dad and ask them to not try to experiment with them and like do any kind of things because obviously this will be a bigger problem and the things that um, he was fearing that it might like give a bad reputation to the magicians uh, which is the enemy's actual plan like okay Tasuya like really um, uh, pinpointed it the like hidden agenda behind why the parasites were like uh, um, like sent over here so that happened and then like they get assassinated by uh, no uh, no sorry uh, after that uh, Kuroba calls uh, Virginia gives her the location and asks her whether she wants them back or not she agree she wants them she says yes I want them back and then he she like asks and Angelina to kill, kill them, to assassinate them. Angelina goes and assassinates them. This, uh, like, Tasuya gets to know this, and now he gets uh, contacted by Raymond, who also wants them assassinated, the parasites killed, and wants Tasuya to do that and help him in his, uh, like, uh, like, plan. So, <laughs> yeah, a lot of things. And there were a lot of information in this episode as well, and I'm not sure uh, if I'll be able to like remember them all at once. But uh, base the basic things I kind of got, and the basic thing I'm like I most will I'll be able to remember. But um, just a sec. Um. Okay. Uh, Eat Haig. Okay, I doubt I'll remember his name. I might remember Raymond's name because that is quite easy. But Deed Hake, also known as Duji, 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 stateless overseas Chinese person. Duji, supreme leader of the international terrorist organization Blanche. Okay, yeah, that we know. Uh, he's the boss of Hajime Sukasa. Uh, who you caught uh, the leader of Blanche Japanese branch okay so Blanche Japanese branches boss or leader was Hajime Sukasa whose boss is this guy uh, G -G I forgot oh my god <laughs> these names G the Hague. G the okay yeah I'll try to remember Okay, so yeah, so he is like the boss of uh, Sukasa. And another thing they said, uh, just a sec, let me just uh, go over this again, like quite 
lot of information also a senior member of richard sun's group the previous leader of international crime syndicate no head dragon okay well in season one we got to uh, like the no head dragon came in and in, in no head dragon they called Gujie the black elder or the great hag hmm okay um just because he's one of the said uh, okay he said uh, this before okay it refers to this like uh, the seven sages it refers to the seven operators with accesses access privileges to legi skulls okay so yeah all right so these seven people they have this uh, privilege to that uh, back door that they were talking about of echelon 3 legi skull <laughs> my god Gigi Skull is one of the additional expansion systems of Echelon 3. Okay. Global monitoring system. Since it uses a backdoor in Echelon 3, it's called a hacking system lurking within the system. Okay, so within the system is a hacking system of whose like uh, access these seven sages has. Wow, a lot of things. My god. Okay, um, this scalp uh, collects information from throughout the world and gives information along with such matches to the operators. Okay, the operators being the seven sages. So that means like the seven sages knows everything. Like they'll just go and like put an information, put a keyword, just like in Google. <laughs> like, <laughs> like we uh, search for some kind of like, uh, for example, when will this uh, like when will this movie air or when will uh, like uh, what's happening in the world? We go and Google it, and these guys go and like Google like what's happening to uh, my neighbor's house? What's happening in my neighbor's house? Why were they so <laughs> like noisy yesterday? <laughs> these kind of things. <laughs> wow, just. Okay. Um, the system <laughs> decides who the operators will be. Okay, so the system decides itself. Okay, so. And we haven't found any logic on how it chooses people. So, this guy, um, uh, Raymond, he was also like chosen randomly by the system. Okay. It's completely random. Okay. And using Hilgis Scalp is a risk to the operators too. Okay. Operator search history saved. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Now I'm gonna like, I was reacting at that moment. So like none of the things went into my head properly. Okay, I'm guess getting everything now. Search history records are how I learned about Git Hague. Okay. Then wouldn't Git Hague also know about Raymond? Co yeah. Okay, all right. When Blanche, Japanese branch went under, and Nohe Dragon lost his Japanese headquarters, he lost all his ways to influence Japan. Okay. He was the one who set up the passage to come to Japan too. Goal is to rebuild his spy base in Japan by taking advantage of the chaos. I've deciphered that his goal is to destroy magic through, uh, through social means. Okay, after this we know everything. So, okay, that became a lot clearer. Okay, I'm sorry about this, but I had to like check this portion again. Like, it went, a lot of things went over my head, but now I'm kind of getting the whole picture. Alright, so, yep, a lot of things are happening in the background. And this is nothing like related to Tatsuya or Japan. This is all like happening in the, uh, like, uh, inside the Seven Sages, like, uh, uh, like one of the seven sages like they're planning this and I don't know about the others But this Raymond does not want whatever this, that his plan is and he wants to stop it So that's all well and good like he is Like our ally kind of But who knows like these type of people like these guys like who like especially with blonde hair uh, a very like a pretty face like, uh, like they're like in animals I've seen in this. Like that, like these type of people usually they're like two ways they can like turn out. Number one, they're extremely intelligent. They are extremely like crafty 
and cunning and they kind of like mess with people and uh but sometimes they are might also be good like um in a few animes i've seen it uh, either that otherwise they're extremely dumb they're stupid they are like like they boast about everything and they are like worthless like these are the two categories of this type of a character like uh, this type of a person and obviously this guy is a sage i'm guessing he's like the former category like he's extremely uh, like intelligent crafty and cunning and would probably has some kind of secrets <laughs> and uh, who knows if he is an actual ally or an ally who is like this like who's disguising himself as an ally but most probably wants something bad i don't know or maybe he is neutral who knows anyways um yeah and okay so that was uh, basically this that and the only kind like kind of concern i have is about um pixie like what's going to happen to her so yeah i don't know like like this guy seems pretty much uh, one of those guys like he said like he um like, like said it quite strongly that i want every one of the parasites to be dead I don't know. Let's see what's going to happen. Mm, all right, and yeah, the only kind of question I still have uh, have in this uh, episode is about uh, why Virginia like called like mailed um, Angelina to assassinate them. I'm still not sure about that. Most probably uh, because uh, one of those guys were from their like uh, army. That might be the reason, or that might not be reason. I might be misinterpreting it anyways oh and also another thing that happened in this episode was about uh, the whole like pixie like the thing that she did uh, previously like that kind of like flashbang kind of thing that uh, she did so uh, like honoka was I'm, I'm thinking like honoka was like uh, like obviously like want, wanting the good for tatsuya and like her feelings that was in that um air ornaments uh, that like uh, made a wave like scion waves which went and uh, interacted with pixie who is also because like like pixie because he uh, woke up when uh, through like honoka's feelings uh, that was the reason why they resonated and like resonance is the correct word like uh, their like wavelengths kind of became like the same so like he suddenly got some huge amount of power and like the psychic power and uh, like robots or she even though she's an android she was able to like protect them uh, protect honoka so yeah so basically um power of love <laughs> oh boy okay so yeah that was this episode um this was episode number nine of mahoka koko no retose and um yeah a lot of information a lot of things i'm still not sure if i had been able to like properly understand each and everything but i basically like i got the basic gist of it and i kind of like got everything and what's happening so yeah i think i'm like okay nothing uh like i i think i hope i did not miss anything from this episode so yeah um so yeah guys and uh, this was episode number nine so if you guys enjoyed my reaction press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel if you haven't subscribed please be sure to do so and comment down below uh, if you have anything you want to say be sure to comment down below i'll be sure to check them out as well so yeah um so yeah guys uh, thanks for watching again i'll be back with a new mahoka koko no retose uh, episode next week same time so until then goodbye and have a nice day